What's up folks, thanks for stopping by my channel. Today I'm gonna to show you guys something really cool within Share Factory. It's how to speed up or slow down a particular clip in your video. Uh, I'm gonna show you how to do that really, really quickly. It's really simple, really easy. Let's go. Okay, so in order to speed up or slow down a clip, obviously you need to section off the portion in which you wanna slow or speed up. So in this case, I have a Fortnite video here uh, where I'm running and I see I've gotten into a car. So I'm gonna use this part here and I'm going to speed up the car. So from this point on, I'm gonna press square, go to split clip, press X to start the split right here, confirm it. Um, and I'm gonna let it run a little bit to see where I wanna end the split. And let's see, it's gonna go on a little bit through this bridge. And let's say from right here. So here's when I wanna end the scene. I'm going to press X again and confirm to split clip. Now I'm going to press circle to back out of the split edit section. And now if you see, I've, I've sectioned off this, this area here that I've wanted to adjust a little bit with speed. So now what you're going to do is you're going to press square while your cursor is within here. Uh, you're going to press square and you're going to go to time bender. It's the very first um, option here. Um, go to time benders and press X. And now initially when you see this, it might be a little bit confusing, but it's really not. It's very, very, very simple. Currently the square in the middle is the current speed, the default speed uh, of, of your gameplay. So if you want to speed it up, you would go to the right. There's three options, right? Um, you can speed it up by two times, four times, eight times. Or you can go to the left and you can split it. Uh, into half speed, a quarter speed, or one eighth speed, which is really slow. Uh, so depending on what you want. So in this case, I want to speed up this car a little bit. Uh, I'm just going to say we're going to go to four times speed here. Uh, you're going to select it by pressing X. And as you see, it says uh, it has a time better symbol. It says four times and it's turned purple. You know that that specific scene has been sped up by four times. So if we go back and watch it, right, get in the car and... Here we go. It's pretty fast. It's so fast that it's it's choppy even. So you know what? I didn't like that. I, I didn't like how choppy it was. So I'm going to go back and adjust it. I'm going to go back within that scene. I'm going to press square. Go back to time bender. And I'm going to select the two times instead. Press X. And let's see that. I like that a little bit better. It's a little bit more of a realistic speed. Um, it's not choppy. It gets to the point. Right? There we go, speeding through the bridge there. And now back to normal speed. Perfect. Now if I want to slow down something, let's let's find a, a part where I want to slow down. Uh, so I, I, I've stolen this other random vehicle and I crashed into a gas station right here. So I want that explosion to be one of those movie explosions, you know, just like slow motion, right? So... I need to split this clip first. So from right here, I'm gonna say, I'll split it right here. So square, uh, split clip, press X, right there, confirm. Uh, let's go to the little explosion. As you can see, I'm gonna slowly go by, boom. Okay, it exploded. Now I'm gonna press X again to confirm that split. And it's just a little tiny piece right here. We're gonna press circle to back out of the split option. And we're gonna just keep our cursor in this little section, press square. Go back to time bender, and now you're going to use the the uh, options to the left. So I'm going to do it uh, one quarter speed and, and see how that goes. I'm going to press X on one quarter right there, and as you can see, uh, it's been confirmed right here. So if I play it back, slow motion explosion, there it is. And that's it, folks. It's really that simple. Um, it's a really cool feature to use within Share Factory. I hope this video helped you guys out there. Um, if it did, please leave a subscribe on this channel for more content. Also, check out my gaming videos that I made using Share Factory. Uh, check them out. And thank you guys so much for watching. Really appreciate it. Hope to see you next time. Take care.